San Francisco District Corps of Engineers completed the Dry Creek Reach 15 restoration project at Lake Sonoma three weeks ahead of schedule. This portion of the larger Dry Creek restoration is a $1.8 million project along 1,600 feet of Dry Creek, just downstream from the outlet works of Warm Springs Dam. The purpose is to try and rehabilitate the coho salmon and steel runs that historically came up the Russian River watershed. The newly completed secondary channel runs parallel to Dry Creek to provide low flow for salmon to rest, feed, and spawn in. So the fish can say, hey look, here's a small, smaller channel, the flow is a lot less severe, so we're going to hang out and go right instead of going up the main flow, and they're going to find that it's going to be a lot gentler flow because the grading is much less than what Dry Creek's is. After excavation, the channel was filled with two to four inches of cobblestone for armoring purposes and to form a habitat for fish to spawn in. And then large woody material was placed all along the creek using excavated trees and boulders. What the trees are going to do is they're going to provide food for the fish. The, the water's going to break down the tree over time and create all these nutrients and microbes for the fish to feed on. Finally, willow spikes taken from trees cut down during excavation were planted every 10 to 15 feet along the project site. Eventually, these willows will grow up and create a nice canopy for this low flow channel and provide some nice shade for the, for the salmon. This project, along with the Corps' Russian River Coho Salmon Captive Broodstock Program, are part of an ongoing effort to increase the chances of survival for endangered coho salmon in the Russian River watershed.